Derek sitting by an open fire. Oh man, it's so warm. I love it. Happy New Year. Thank you for joining me, pipe smokers. We're going to look back on 2017 and we're going to talk about my top five favorite pipe tobaccos of the year. And it was real easy because when I went to the hutch and I reached in, these were the ones that were just right there. These are the blends that I've smoked the most this year and that I enjoy. And it's going to be a little bit different here in 2018 because I am going to smoke only new blends for 2018. If I've had it before, not smoking it this year, but that's another video. Anyway, let's get down to it. Top five blends with an honorable mention. My honorable mention this year is Velvet. I needed to include like a nice pouch codger blend and Velvet's it. Real good. Real nice. Real easy to smoke. All right. Let's get to it. Number four. Available exclusively at PipesAndCigars.com. I've mentioned this many times before. I still enjoy it quite a bit. And it is Hearth and Homes Chatham Manor. Um, easily the one of the best tobaccos for beginners. It is well behaved. It is tasty, nice, burly. It's got a good cocoa flavor, good sweetness. Doesn't uh, offer tongue bite. It's very mild. It's just a well behaved tobacco. Normally, guys, this is $27 for this 12, uh, 14 ounce tub. Not only is it a good tobacco, it's a good value. Take the plunge. Order you a tub. And if you don't like it, send it to me, which people have done before. And I appreciate it. Um, great, great blend. All right. Number four. We're also going to go with a hearth and home blend which is available exclusively at pipesandcigars.com hearth and homes magnum opus i love this stuff i recently ordered a bunch of it i've ordered a bunch before it's just a great balanced lot kia blend it's got lot kia it's got sweetness it's just it it's great don't don't even hesitate so good. All right. Number two, uh, number three, sorry, number three. How about, let's go with a quintessential Virginia Perique. I could have thrown in Cabby's mixture, but let's be honest. Escudo is always going to be the king. Get your Escudo. Age your Escudo. All right. It's not so, it's, it's fine if it's fresh, but when you age it, it provides just this complex depth, gets sweeter, gets plummier, gets a good spice to it. Escudo, aged. Let's see, number two. And oh, Escudo, you can get that anywhere, all right. Number two is available only at smokingpipes.com because the shop that it was originally available at just shut down. And I'm talking about Kramer's Father Dempsey. All right. Kramer's Tobacco, it was the shop, if it's, it was the place to go to. Located in Beverly Hills, had tons of celebrity clientele, and Father Dempsey was the blend that a local priest had Mr. Kramer himself blend up to resemble Dunhill's My Mixture 965. So we all know that Dunhill's going away in the United States. So if you love My Mixture 965, standard Texan, I'm looking at you. Um, if you like 965, get you some Father Dempsey. Just a wonderful, balanced English. I love English blends. I love Latakia. This is perfect. I love it. So what's my number one? My number one blend has been on my list ever since I've had it. 
It is an aromatic English crossover. It is available everywhere. It is one of my favorite blends. It's probably one of your favorites. And it is Frog Morton's Cellar. With the, uh, with the little block that it comes with, Frog Morton Cellar is an English blend that has been flavored with whiskey. It's not overpowering. The Latakia is not overpowering. The flavoring is not overpowering. It is just a nice, mild to medium English blend with a nice little topping of flavor. And it is so good. I love it. It'd be probably one of my Desert Island blends if I had to choose. It's great. It's great for beginners. It's great if you've been smoking for years. Is my fire out? It's smoldering. The fire's smoldering. And that's fine. I'll let it smolder. It's still producing heat. Anyway, guys, I want to welcome everyone to 2018. I want to thank you so much for supporting my channel, for supporting me. Uh, my recent giveaway, I, ha I had a winner. Scott Carter, you need to get in contact with me if you haven't done so, so far. Um, this has been a wonderful year. I'm expecting 2018 to be even better. So I wanna thank you all for watching my channel and uh, subscribe if you haven't. I plan to continue to produce very informative and also funny content uh, continually, because that's what I'm known for. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all, and smell my beard.